but I'm not sure about. I'm going to let this do its thing while I take my kids to bed, guys. Be right back. Scott Plants has connected. I don't even know really where it is. I don't fucking remember. I don't barely remember that conversation. I just remember getting invited and I said I'd bring some food. Uh, 
on the easternmost on the most eastern side of the map. So here. There is no walking into that. <sighs> what? It's up to you, Pikmin lover. Said he's done with the edges tail. Who should he do next? It's not linear. You can pick. Yeah, you can pick up until you get them all done, and then the last four, it's just like uh, they force you into the last four in order, or three. I'm gonna go down. Well, okay. It's like, wait a minute. I did finish my milk. Uh, from Baron, fly directly south. Alright, we're here. Oh, okay, so we are going down here. We're going to raid all of this. Diamond armlet. Pikmin didn't hear what you said about who he should do next after I did his tail. Pikmin, just choose because it's you're going to end up in any story that you end up in. Uh, regardless, you're going to end up hearing the same stuff now that you've learned in Edge's Tale, and vice versa. Whew. 
Nasty worm. Figure everything out. Seven. Yep. And seven can take like four days. Simple game. phone sex you might get hearing aids <laughs> what wow. don't have phone sex you might get hearing aids <laughs> that's oh my goodness where's that one from somebody's twitch channel thing oh my goodness that's funny Wow, she's so tough. Are we under a new moon? No, wow. Okay. Oh. I said, oh. I forgot. That we actually have a little money now for things. Yeah. You have like ten dollars. Woo woo. Ah. Ow. Hey look, it's Sandshrew. Uh, just some of those Kickstarter Mountain Dews if you can. Just a few. Yeah. Hmm? Um, what tail? What, that I'm on or that you, you want picked? Uh, shoot, play the girls. You got Porum and Rydia. So I'd go for the girls. Shoot. Does he mind who plays? 
Your new what? Okay. Okay. Okay, the, the Kickstarter Mountain Dew. If they have the buffalo uh, pretzels, that's it. Let's see. Well, I don't know where this treasure chest is that I'm supposed to walk into a tree and it's got a monster in a box in it. Join us in the heist game key. I am joining no one. <laughs> I see you, Draven. One of us. One of us. This room by a moat, two bridges from the castle. Fly southeast. A short distance. Look for a clearing and some trees. Alright, so apparently we are looking for these tails. I guess the tails are a priority. Like, through this, this guide. Doja, I have a few select words for you. Give me my share. Make me. Alright, outside, five minutes. I'll bring cupcakes. I like cupcakes after beating somebody's ass. <laughs> <laughs> Lowe's stack. Oh, young or yang at this rate.
Nice. Okay, Fabu, fly southeast a short distance, look for a clearing with in some trees. Maybe it's over here on these islands. I don't know. Yeah, Yang's tail. I think I just figured out the thing they were talking about over here. I think I was supposed to go back to this island and grab something on the end of the on the edge of the island here. Yeah, there's some trees. 
furthermost eastern spot. There's a tree just chilling on the island. Oops. Yeah, Flare Tornado leveling up. Here we go. Let's literally save. Well, heal up first and then save. Emerges from the chest. Here's what I was looking for. Damn it. That group is super tough. All right, so we are gonna set this up like this. It's saying to use the cockatrice summon to make things easier. No! Damn it! All right, we're gonna try this one more time because holy crap. Ouch. Be right back. I'm going to go open the door.
much better. Got a Mountain Dew. Kickstart. Yeah, thank you. I'm getting my butt whooped. Ah, oh, darn it. Yes. Big throw on the big man in front. Come on. Sweet. Oof. All right, all right. Summon Cockatrice. I've never seen this one. Here we go. All right. Okay. Learn to drain. Okay. Diamond armor. Hoo hoo. Um. All right. So we figured out what this was saying on the island to do that. in the sky. Okay. You'll learn that you can't enter the castle through the front gate. You'll have to find another way or turn the airship. If you finish collecting all the items you need, answer yes. You'll now be in the control of the airship. Enable flight around the airship. Also has room with lots of bed. You're stepping onto the stairs. Search the beds on the east side of the room. You'll be asked if you want to rest. Fully restore your party. Change the moon phase. It's just like using an inn. Won't cost you a single gill. Dragon okay. has left the server. We're gonna go heal. We're gonna go heal up. Thank you for the pretzels, babe. Boom, boom, boom. All right. We're using like an offhand uh, walkthrough that, that doesn't exactly like state too much.
Okay. We did that. Now, let's head to Fabul. Right? Alright, we'll have diamond armor. Okay, you're not ready to face the chick yet. So, to Fabul we go again. Locate Fabul. This is a castle surrounded by a moat. From the castle, fly southeast a short distance. Look for a clearing in some trees. Look for a clearing. Oh, you're watching it again. There's a clearing in some trees. Feel better?
Hmm. Like, some of this is right, but some of it isn't. Can I... Can I check that one? There we go. Yep, here we go. I found it. It is so hard to find the right one, too. Okay, and this says that I'll get a fairy rod, okay. So much grab. Diamond dust. Here we go. and hit hit the uh man in black ah. I'm gonna lose this fight but I uh, will
We're gonna reset this up and cast Reflect on everyone. So, here we go. Make sure I have it. Or maybe we don't know that particular ability. Fira, 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 come on. Luca.
Yeah. Watch. We got it, guys. We finally do. We're healing people, and we're taking out the boss. The, these these bad guys. Love you too. Mage Masher, really? to rest on board. This is crazy. Having to do all this work to prep up for the end game. I'm going to guess the end game is like that tough. Really? Yeah. Having to do a bunch of stuff. Yeah. Tsunami. Uh oh. Snakes that can summon a tsunami? Just trading it. Well, in addition to adding a new zone with its new own new bounties to tackle, the rewards gained from bounties have been revived. Nephilim rifts no longer require rift fragments to enter. Yeah! To change the incentive yeah. behind completing bounties. In addition to being the only way to obtain the new X specific crafting materials used with the cube, we've shifted the reward from bounties to focus on being the primary source for gold and crafting materials. 
It's also a great way to complete your crafting recipe collection, as each cache guarantees at least two crafting recipe drops, if you are missing any. If you want to craft a bunch of stuff, bounties are now the place to go and get started. So what's that mean for us at Endgame already? I'm still reading this is something they posted today in the news section as of nine hours ago. Oh, jeez. Not to mention... Let's see. So, yeah. If you, uh... After you finish that, you pull up Battle.net, click on D3, go through the... hit the arrow on the deal there that says Test Realm now available. I'll bring you to a picture that says Adventure Mode Patch 2.3.0 Preview, which is telling you everything they're doing as of this moment. Oh, sweet. Eek. Greater Rift tiers are labeled with their approximate difficulty level, as always. Um, greater Rift keys are now able to drop from Rift Guardians at any difficulty level, including normal through Torment 1. Chance scales up to 100% at Torment 6. And there is additional scaling chance for a second key to drop in the new Torment level 7 through 10. Oh, did they open up uh, Torment oh, 7 through 10 finally? When they send out the new patch. Oh, this okay. Is stuff before oh, okay. the preview they're doing. Oh, hey, this is what definitely is going live with the new patch so far. This patch will be basically right around the corner, is what they're meaning by putting this out. Yep. So I may actually log into the PTR realm and level up the character. Nice. Greater grip keys are now only right needful here. for one level that can no longer be upgraded. Instead, when you successfully complete a Greater Rift, you'll automatically get the Legendary Gem Upgrade screen. Please note, you will no longer get the Gem Upgrade screen if you fail to complete a Greater Rift. Our concern is that players might tackle a Greater Rift well beyond their ability just for a chance at upgrading. This experience would feel sluggish and miserable. It isn't something we want to incentivize. Oh, so now if you don't complete it within its time, you don't get to upgrade your gems? Correct. So there's no incentive to actually do higher greater rifts now. And you're capped out at well, the only the greater rift that you can complete, right? Yeah. So, like, if you can only go to Greater Rift 34, your gem will only upgrade to level 34 now? You still have that slim chance of it upgrading, but chances of it upgrading are nil to none. Yeah, 0 to 10%. There's also been several other balance uh, changes made to rifts, including tweaks to rift guarding and mechanics, enemy health, and the progress needed to even out the amount of time you spend clearing regular enemies versus fighting the Guardian. For more information, we recommend checking the full PTR patch notes or simply giving the PTR self a go. Okay, so basically everything we were doing before is now non-void because of this whole new system. Like, you can't grind and go through that greater rift of, like, 40 and just, like, take hours to do it to get that extra level on your gym. Yeah. One way to nerf it. Just one way to nerf it. See, that's how I... There's also tweaks to the... Sorry, go ahead. Oh, I was just going to say, that's why I gave up on Blizzard a long time ago. They never really... Any update I've ever done in any of their games has always been backpedaling. Well, they're, they're changing well, they're... incentives and they're wanting people to actually do the bounties now. 
instead of grinding greater rifts that we've been doing for two big game patches. And this is what I meant, guys, when I said that Blizzard has a flavor of the month. This is their way of changing it up. They're forcing you to play a whole nother way now. But don't worry. Give it give it one month and there's going to be a bunch of different exploits yeah. and guaranteed ways to play. To make your, your leveling up progress a lot easier. They're also changing stuff involving the infernal like, machines. So the Hellfire Amulet is getting changes. Oh, great. Few minor but meaningful tweaks. The largest piece of feedback we've heard regarding the Hellfire Amulet and its counterpart ring is these items often help to get it by multiple levels of luck. The time investment was high, and even after dedicating the amount of time, the payoff wasn't guaranteed. Nope. Which, yes, that's true. It wasn't guaranteed ever. But that was the thing with it. That I like. You had that chance. Love you too. While we want the Hellfire items to be an investment, we slimmed down the process to make it less time intensive to complete. To start, there is no longer a need to craft Hellfire machines. The recipes have been removed from the game, and each keyboarder now has a chance to drop an appropriate Infernal Machine. The chance for an Infernal Machine to drop remains the same through, though now appropriately continues to scale into the newer tournaments. In addition, the Hellfire Amulet is now guaranteed to roll with the socket. This removes a layer of luck to acquiring the perfect complement to your gear and should overall make the time invested into crafting one of these items feel well spent. So what? Okay. What's the big important thing now? They, they're taking out the Infernal Machine of War recipe and all that. Literally, your key wardens are now going to drop what you need to go and fight the bosses to get the materials for the Hellfire Amulet. Okay. In the ring. Okay. That is what they are changing there. They are basically cutting out head. Right. Oh, they're cutting out the and keys. To go there to. Yeah, you get the keys literally straight off the wardens now. Oh, you mean the the materials to make the Hellfire amulet, or to go to the Uber? The keys that you get to go to the Uber bosses to get the materials. Come off. Of it. Okay, so we're still getting the keys from the key wardens. From the key wardens. Yeah. You're just literally getting the key itself instead of having to make a machine with the different keys. Oh, okay, okay. So you're getting the true full actual key. You get a chance with any warden at its usual rates. Shoot, I might uh, I might boot up uh, Diablo tomorrow before the stream or after. I don't know. We we may this decides this may decide a lot of things. I'll check some things out tonight after the stream and uh, see if this decides that we'll take a day break in between the two Final Fantasies and uh, rush through seven when we start it. Maybe the day after tomorrow. I'll, uh, I'll tweet, guys. I'll tweet. Don't worry. There's a lot of mechanics that are changing. That's why I'm, I'm, I'm getting interested.
There we go, we got that tail. Yeah, these 14 tails are probably the most important part of the game right now, besides some of this gear I'm finding. It's working now that I know what I'm looking for, too. I'm quite literally looking for this weird crater. It's not black, and it doesn't have lines in it. It's literally a crater that's been domed down. So, this spot right here that I'm, like, sitting just above. It's neat, though. It's neat. Now that I know, this is going to make this, this guide a lot easier to manage. Not to mention, we did pick up some items already. Head to Troya. I believe we just did this one. Because we did it right here. Let's see. Troy is a castle city surrounded by dense forests. Okay. Walk north in the forest. To the far north is another clearing. And in the clearing, see a treasure chest. Use secret passage through some trees on the east part of the room to reach it. And I figure, okay. Whoa! They are making me walk seriously far. Okay. Is that all the way east now as well? Because we did the one to the north. Enter this clearing, see a treasure chest, use a secret passage through some trees on the east part of the room to reach it. There's an ice whip inside the chest. Yep. Check a bush in the room as well to find another small tail. Oh crap. So we gotta go back and check for a small tail. small tail there all right we've got a small tail to the east to let her sit in there by herself? Crazy. Alright, we gotta come back up here. Yay. 
Yeah, we went up there, we got that chest. That's right. Okay, so we did get a tail from here, if I'm not mistaken. Because it was like right up here. So we must have gotten the small tail from here. Let's move on. I'm going to be going on the public test from. Alrighty. See what it's like. Since apparently in that I uh, don't have to be using <laughs> no more. Yep, we did this one. <laughs> oh man, this game is amazing. Ordeals. Okay. Here we go. That's not Mount Ordeals. Mount Ordeals is up here. Right. Is here. Right here is Mount Ordeals. Alright, what about Mount Ordeals? of here. until you reach a small circular force surrounded by a larger one.
Okay. Where are you flying to now? I'm, uh... I'm flying to get a bunch of, like, items and stuff in-game. Ribbon, let's see. Ah, um, resistant to various status animals, resistant to mage tanks. Later. Can I get an invite to your clan? You're in? Oh, to, uh, Brotherhood? Yep. Yeah. Alright. Launch the airship, yes. Now we're going north of here. You on the boss fight yet? No. I'm still fucking flying around gather having to gather items, which is fine because now I'm actually able to have equipment that's a little like beefy for my characters because some of them's health is like super low. <laughs> Wait a minute, I don't think I'm supposed to go this far north. Fly directly north until you find a meteor impact site surrounded by three smaller impact sites. Fly directly north. Here? We're going to save right here. Well, we're gonna cottage. We're gonna... Better yet, let's see, what are we looking at? We can go no, uh, and go rest for free, which is my plan now. robe and we won't have to fight to claim this item. Wait, equip. I already have a luminous robe. Okay. Let's look for a cave just slightly southeast of Mount Odeals. All 
right, there's a cave literally right over here. I'm, I'm just following the guide at this point. We've been here earlier. Just like double checking all my bases. Okay, we got the tail from there. Come up here, there was a tail and a chest. a character over from the realm you play on when you go to the BTR, so you're not starting from brand new. I'll fly directly yeah, east to find the tower of so you can copy your demon hunter over. Nice. We would play on it if you had to start over on the tester. Okay. Single tree on the edge of the map. Found a small tail. to the east of the Babel. We've raised so far True Man of War has literally dropped $25 this month to the total donations for this for this new month. Uh, basically Oh wait, well yeah, he's donated a total of uh, 20, 50 at the beginning of the month, 25 just recently, so that puts us at 75 out of our 125 for the current total for the month. East from the Tower of Babel. There it is, small tail. Flying to Damsian Castle, got it. These tails are important. I do not know why either. <sighs> Dampsian Castle. Okay. Fly west of the castle. Look for a large meteor impact site on the ground. Examine the bones, small tail. Now from Damsian, fly south to see a cave entrance below.
Oof, man. Talk about some serious work. They are really making me go for it. Like, this might be a two-parter. They're probably talking about this cave right here. Love you too, babe. <sighs> from the cave entrance, fly further south. From the cave entrance, fly further south. Into your positioned over some mountains. Okay. Now fly west. You'll reach an island with a small forest land your airship and walk into the forest to enter a chuckabo forest. Oh, wonder Jesus. Oh, God. This, this island right here. Really, they couldn't have just said that. An island to the west with a forest on it. Stop yawning. Who, me? I will punch you in the mouth. Like to see you punch me through the computer screen. I'm on my way. All right. I'm call Wait, up the last base record. Get some set out and stand by. What's the closest base to you? Uh, I want to say it's Youngstown Air Force Base. Uh, the the was the right Air Force Base, right Patterson. Okay. I could be wrong about the name though. I could be. I'm terrible with those. I might just have to wait until TwitchCon. Ah, I'll show up to TwitchCon with a fist imprint in my beard. <laughs> the beard will absorb it. <laughs> Yep. What is that? A fist tried to hit me. My beard protected me. I've not bothered to trim my beard at all, guys. I've literally just been combing it and, and shampoo and conditioning every day. So, we could see a huge beard come TwitchCon. Um, it's still up, though, to force me to shave my head for breaking the for reaching our cap of three thousand dollars on the summer blast charity fund this goes to supporting the stream and getting giveaways and basically all around it's it's for you guys and the stream in the end um, we've raised a, a decent amount of money in the beginning to now it's we're we're pushing I think something like four hundred dollars. <laughs> it's it's you know a start, but it's it's up until we go to TwitchCon. If we don't reach the three thousand dollar marker, basically uh, I don't have to shave my head. But if we reach three thousand dollars, I'll have no hair going to TwitchCon. I'll be completely bald. You ain't touching that beard, sir. No, the beard, the beard stays. I was going to say, I'd be taking my donations back. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> okay, so literally what it does now, you get a it's fly rip, further south. greater rift key. And you get to tell it, this from okay, I want to do teach this difficult. Difficult. You can also safely enter a Dancing Castle itself and search for treasure. Antlions won't attack you if you don't speak to them. That's See the Dancing Castle out. section of this guide for more details. Yeah. And NSG underscore mm. nation has connected. It's going to make Russian people easier, too, because they're not going to have to have keys no more. Say what now? You just pick the greater rift level at the rift. Oh, it auto-picks for you? 
No, you get to choose what level you want to do it at. Oh, man. That's going to be really funky. Know what I mean? Yeah, but you'll be able to rush people fast now. They yeah. Don't have to have keys. That's very true. Saved you from having to go for the Fly wave south after of the castle of the enemies. Seen Oasis. All right, so we are going here. NSG, NSG underscore nation has connected. Land nearby and walk south of the town. has left the server. A boss has connected. This thing looks nasty. Oh, well, we killed it. Uh, here we go. Fly east until you see a bridge. And south. Call me cheese has left the server. Then fly south and follow the stretch of land to the southeast until you find a C-shaped area with a small patch of yellow. Calvi Cheese has connected. Okay, we've been here. We did this already. That was that great Malboro that whooped our butt, but we did it. We got the black belt gi as our reward. Be very handy if you haven't reported it. Check the pillars surrounding the chest as well for a small tail on one of them. Got it. Calby Cheese has connected. This last one. All right, we're done. Audi 5000 here.
Um, we've got all the help we can get. Okay. That should cover... these tails. I think they're a random item. You can definitely tell they have it jacked up with the uh, amount of legendaries. Small tails. Bronze and silver. Grab your remote. All right. Speak to those guys. Let's see, we could speak to Mithril for anything we can't use right now. We've gained control of them. Let's see. There's just eh, some decent items. Uh, we've gone to Kaipo. We've done that. We've woke them up. Okay. So we kind of did all of the, the main story stuff without even realizing it. I'm, I'm noticing this. Uh, the Castle Blaze. You'll encounter a lot of fire-based enemies here. Uh, if you picked up some Ice Claws at Fabul, Edge may be able to make good use of them here. Main castle entrance is blocked by fierce fire, so you'll need to look for an alternate route to the throne room. Let's start by going to the East Tower. Follow the East Path and enter the tower. Shortly past the door, you'll encounter Ifrit. Run to escape the battle. Do this each time you encounter it. So the castle is burning and everyone is in a panic. But that doesn't mean we can't still grab some treasure. Okay. Thumbs on the ground. This will take you to a secret path that you can follow to a treasure chest. What? Okay. Back to Eblin, my friends. Back to Eblin. We're going back to the castle of Edge and the Ninja Clan. Because apparently there's a lot that we can do here. And apparently Ifrit is part of it. Edge. Dicopomorpha Ekmet for riches has connected. Okay. Bomb crank and flame shield. Nice. Band skill broken heart leveled up.
Okay. We'll run each time we encounter Ifrit. Apparently, it's not good to fight him because it's just game over anyway. Uh, we've already seen that. So, so here we go. Gorilla Gamer, what's up, man? I'm trying to read a guide at this point because I got stuck. I got real stuck earlier after three hours. Didn't know what else I had to do. It was The game is not exactly uh, telling you or giving you clues or hints. We have a hooded figure coming up. That's a melt man. I think melt mans apparently have some high experience, but... Huh. Hey, baby girl. You going shopping? Are you going shopping, baby girl? <laughs> My baby girl's walking around with her mom's purse. Go. It's upstairs, my bad. Edge's bedchamber. Let's see, items, obviously, we're just gonna go straight up potions. The other two are you and Nostalgia Bot. Ah, there's other folks. A boss has left the server. We got a lot of lurkers. People lurking. Playing like the same game for three days in a row. Who, me? No, Burke. Like Dead Realm or whatever. Ah. Oh. It's like one, it's like a multiplayer jump scare game. Gotcha. gotcha. One person starts out as a ghost and the rest are humans, and the ghosts have to find the humans, and the humans have to hide. And then when you get caught by this ghost, you turn into a ghost. And this, the humans have to survive to win, or the ghosts get all the humans to win. And this is the second day they're also hitting satellites. Huh. Like you got him and him, Satellizer and Doc got gameplay. Doc got gameplay yesterday. Ah. Uh. Not today, him and are doing it again. If, if anybody is Satellite out there, please like type. Wow. 
That was so much easier. Why'd you get it now? I destroyed the thing in front of me. I was right. I knew it. I was going to have to destroy those big guys to help Eblin Castle. Dang, and that took me so long to figure out. Grim Greetings has connected. Nice man, nice Xanth. I'm uh I'm working through the last episode right now, man. Oh, I went to West Tower first. Oops. Now I'm going to East Tower. You played on the hard difficulty? Nice. Now I'm heading to the East Chamber. Crew over there hitting me. <laughs> Is it just me or does Luca kind of resemble the way black folks were drawn in those old racist cartoons? What? I guess, but geez. Hey! So much Kappa-ness going on. Alright, we're going to do it again. Ha! One of these. It's not like the others. There's a color Kappa in there. Color. Here we go. All right, I'm going to go get me another drink. Be right back. White magic up, black magic down.
Alright, I've already been downstairs and gotten that chest. So now here we are going back up to try and get to the throne room to face Ifrit. Ifrit's a big deal in the fact that he's an Eidolon, guys. And it's a situation that we are now fighting the Eidolons to get back uh, those summons to Rydia. And this is allowing us to basically get through these fights. I goofed a bit. Darn it, I put it on auto battle and we're using magic and stuff. Stupid is a stupid is, sir. Alright, here we go. Let's see, I need to look at this. Walk south into the wall just past the door and walk east through a secret pass that will lead to a treasure chest. Now go to the stairs, continue to serve base against the wall. Oh, uh, darn it. Looks like I gotta go to the West Tower. There's a small tail there and some other stuff. What up, Xanth? Xanth over there, black mage in those fires. Dropping them that fireball down. Several vases. And I can walk through the wall at some point. That dude hits hard, real hard. Come up here. So, just to give you an idea of how much they have the legendary drop pushed up, went into a rift with nothing on me, I have a full page of legendaries that I found it in. Nice. Who, what, when, why, the man in black. Yeah, it's Golbez, guys. Okay. In the west tower, continue to run from if you walk south into the wall just past the door and walk east past that will lead to a treasure chest. has connected. Something... Not 
here, maybe here. 